and welcome back to World Conquer 3. Now before you ask, yes I am still using my old phone, but tomorrow I am going to bring you a video on my new one. It's not going to be part of any Let's Plays or anything, but yeah, it's going to be a stupid game. But I think that you guys will enjoy that video nevertheless, because at least you'll get to experience it in its fullest potential. You know, I won't have to work around anything. So, yep, that will be coming out tomorrow. I was going to do it today, but then I realized that I haven't done a part of World Conquer 3 in, what, like, six, five days, maybe? Ugh. So, yeah, that's the basic point. And I'm sorry if, well, of course, I did just yawn. Um, I just woke up. Well, ugh. Yep. So, this part, it's actually going to take a look at the map. I really, really want to take Canada and America in this part. I will also need to take Manila, or Manila, however you want to pronounce it. Oh, actually we can, hold up. No, not bomber, paratrooper. There, that should make it easier. But yeah, I want to take Canada and America and possibly India. India is like a, it's like a miscellaneous thing, you know, it's a side quest. Alright. Also guys, um, I wanted to point out. Of course, I have an Xbox One now, so if any of you guys, you know, want to play something or any of that, you know, now you're actually able to, since that I have something to play with you guys on. So yeah, my gamer tag is, of course, Lord Zero Sight, capital L, capital Z. And yeah, if you guys would like to, it's there. I'll be on all day. Ugh. Alright, I got all the news out of the way. That should, um, get rid of the main purpose of this video. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was a horrible joke. Once again, like I said, I am very tired right now. Alright. And, um, let's take a look over here on... Oh, not on, in Europe. So, what I think I... Oh... It appears that Norway is making a push. What I might do this part is I might take um comp well, you know, it's not Finland anymore, but I might take Finland and Leningrad and possibly Riga, basically like this whole north western part. That should um that should give us a pretty good position, and then we can just move our way down into Warsaw, then Berlin. Yeah, that's a good plan. Okay. I'm going with that. Alright. It appears that Moscow is still having trouble. Huh. Alright, I'm sorry about that. <clears throat> I also, oh, sorry about that. I also want to take out um, the Soviet Union. I don't know if it'll happen this episode, but by next episode, I do want to take out the Soviet Union. Because we only had those cities that they have left in um, Europe and, you know, Stalingrad and a couple few still in Russia. And we have finally won this battle over here in the Pacific. Finally. And, yeah, we can end the turn. Oh, and Greece has been defeated. So it appears that Italy has taken Greece. Oh. You know, they actually, la hold on, how many rounds has it been? Oh, they lasted pretty long, considering um, how big of a country they are. Or, I should say, how small of a country they are. But you know what I mean. Do, 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 do. 
We've got um some Egyptian forces over here. I don't know why they're in Europe. Hmm. Egypt needs to stop um focusing on Europe and actually focus about Africa because right now it looks like Spain and Italy are coming for them. Now they need to worry about their own country before they start um starting to conquer others. So I'm trying to say. There, my tanks should take care. Yeah, my tanks are really good against infantry. Which usually tanks aren't in this game. Yeah, usually tanks aren't very good against infantry. But in this case, they are doing very well. God, look how close we are to Warsaw. I'm going to help the uprising. See, I'm not actually going to do it myself. I'm just going to kind of give some weapons, give some money to... Um, the people that are rising in Warsaw. Actually, no, the Warsaw uprising. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Oh, I forgot that I'm um I'm Japan. Yeah, and I'm an Axis force, so that wouldn't work. Because the uprising was because of the Germans, which were Axis. Okay, never mind. And the Soviet Union kind of um you know kind of helped them. And the Soviet Union owns Warsaw now. Okay, just forget what I said. <laughs> um, you know, by now the uprising's already done. Let's see. Why are all my units on fire? Look at this, they're all on fire. Ah, man. Oh, World Conqueror 3, folks. Where units just catch on fire randomly. Dang, I didn't expect my uh, motorized infantry to actually do the job, but they're doing really good. Let's see, those are some very good riflemen. Who is that? Smith. Uh, he's better with ships. Might want to put him on a ship. Oh, he'll be dead soon. So, it doesn't matter. Alright. And we are going to advance, and I'm just going to go straight for Washington, D.C. Like, we aren't going to take a break or anything, we're just heading straight for it. And let's take a look at the defenses over here. Oh, I still need to get Florida and Texas, don't I? But, yeah, Washington is only guarded by a commando. It even doesn't have a general. I mean, New York seems better defended than the country capital oh and we have taken Toronto and that should give us a queer shot at Ottawa and it also um yeah it should also give us a shot at Washington or New York whichever one I want to go for first probably Washington And, oh, I almost forgot about these guys. Mm, Alright. Oh, never mind. We can't take it this turn, can we? Um. No, I can't. Shit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry, but apparently I cannot take America this episode. Um, I forgot about... Let's see, what is this? Do, 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 do. I forgot about Hawaii. Shit. Oh, well. I'm sorry. I kept on, like, gearing this episode up, saying, Oh, yeah, we're going to take America and all this other shit. Yeah, they still have Hawaii. I totally forgot. Oh, and Germany has been eliminated. All right, sorry about that, guys. With the way that my um, old phone is, it just, uh, I can't click the little check mark right there because there's a dead zone on the screen. So I have to end up like skipping over every single time. It's very annoying. But 
Yeah, it looks like... Well, I mean, exactly what happened. Germany is no longer in the fight. So, I think that in Europe, this is going to come down to me, Italy, and Spain. But it looks like Spain's getting ready to be invaded by a big force of French riflemen. Um... This might make this a tad bit more difficult. Because the UK is actually very good in this game. Well, in real life also, but you know what I mean. Um, this could be hard, because, um... Well, I mean, look at Italy and Spain. They've really not done anything. I mean, Italy's taken Greece, yeah. But that's so close to their original country. I mean... I don't think that Spain and Italy are going to be um, much use to me, except for, bo well, yeah, meat shields. You know, have them distract the allies while I move in. Alright, and we have almost taken Stalingrad, finally. It's a very well defended city. Not in terms of units, I just mean it has a lot of uh, city health. Here we are, finally um, getting rid of these Egyptian forces that really shouldn't be in Europe. Huh. Really, Spain, you're just going to sit over there in your city and all that? Okay. I guess Spain is a pacifist now. Okay. Let me see what we have here. Okay, okay, I know what I want to do. And we have taken Bangkok. Finally. Alright. And come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Ah, uh, all right. We're gonna need to sit down uh, my reserves. Whoops. Oh. And I should be good. I'm telling you right now. If these units don't take Mumbai, then it, it's not even worth taking at that point. I mean, really. Okay, and with Manila, we're going to need to send over a couple bombers. Because they just keep on making more units. Actually, they didn't have a unit in here before, did they? They keep on making units. That's what I should say. Man, they have some very good um, anti-aircraft for just being a small island on the Philippines. Or er, the small island of the Philippines. You know what? Just ignore me. Alright, I'm dumb. I'm really dumb. <laughs> small island on the Philippines. Jesus. And I'm not quite sure what to do with these submarines anymore. I mean, I really don't need them. Um, I guess they can go take this dock and go over here to Australia and try to take that dock. Yeah, yeah, really, I don't need those submarines anymore. They're just kind of there. There we are. And we should be taking that um, Texan city pretty easily, so I don't need to center my um, resources on that. Come on, let's take out this rifleman. Alright, you know what? I, I, can't, I can't even send a fighter. Alright, I guess let's just waste our riflemen and armored cars on it. Because hell, my fighters can't just fly over next to Denver. And, it, you know what, no, no, I just, we're, we're just going to go with it. Alright, and I'm going to send this um, rocket artillery over to Washington. I'm just going to set them up here in the mountains. 
And, uh, yeah, because those are commandos, this should be easier. Because, you know, they can't fire back. And they won't even weave Washington, D.C. Because, you know, units never weave their original cities in this game. So... Yeah, that should be all for this turn. And I think that um, we're going to end this episode by the end of next turn, depending on if we take India or not. Actually, no, no. We're going to go for um, two more turns. Well, this turn and the next turn. Then we'll end the episode there. That sounds better. Here we are. Okay, and we're going to head down to um, these islands over here. Like, well, there's Singapore over there, and then basically the islands leading up to Australia is what I want to take. Alright. And let's see if we can't take Mumbai, finally. Oh, yes, my armored car can reach it. Yep, we can take it. Oh, please, please just let me have this city. Please. Ladies and gentlemen, we have conquered India. Hold on, let me see if I can... No, no, I can't press it. Oh, wait, 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 wait you guys saw that? Hold on, believe, believe, I can press it. Believe. Nope, we can't press it, damn it. That is a beautiful sight. Just look at that. What do you look at that? Just look at it. Alright, so we have complete... Well... Wait a minute. No, India was a side objective, wasn't it? Yeah, I said that at the beginning. I think I did. I think that it was India. I'm pretty sure. But anyway, we have taken India. And you know what? That's still a country conquered. We've still accomplished a lot this episode. And by the end of next round, we will end this episode. Because what I want to do is I want to advance farther into America this episode. And hopefully I'll be able to do that with my tanks and stuff. By this turn and next turn. There we are. Take that oil. And we're just going to slowly work our way through the um, Nordic countries over here. Let's see. Yeah, we're just going to mass produce tanks over in Minsk. Or Minsk, however you want to pronounce it. And, uh... Oh, sorry. Yeah. <clears throat> and we're just going to send over three submarines because they might make a ship in that dock when I approach it. And then the other two, I'm just going to send over to Australia. Um, I don't actually expect them to do anything. <laughs> Alright. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. And, come on, let's just take out this rifleman so that we can move on. Nope, nope, okay, that's cool. Jeez, just take him out. There we are, finally. Jeez, that was a very good general. Guy's too good. I mean, seriously, those freaking riflemen. I don't care what general you have. I don't care if freaking Rommel is commanding them. No rifleman unit should be that tough. Alright, and we have made it to DC, which I wanted to do this episode, so yeah, this episode is a success. Hmm. Nope, we're still going to go through one more turn. Romania has been defeated. Well, gosh darn. Alright guys, well there goes another Axis Force. And, um... 
Who took them? Was that Egypt? I think that Egypt might have defeated Romania. No, oh, they still need to focus on their own country. I still stand by that. And, oh man, this is um, some area of land down here. That's um that's gonna be pretty difficult to take because I don't have many units down there. I it's a very like uncomfortable position to be sending troops. Huh. So yeah, that um by Austria Hungary, that's gonna be a lot harder to um take than everywhere else. But we'll take it eventually. Hopefully. And there we are. And um, that's not a very good general on that commando, so don't actually, well, I don't actually expect them to um, do anything. It's just to um, soften them up, to get ready for my tanks. There we are. I'll be able to um, send some rays from that dock down to Australia, so that's why I'm targeting it. Alright. Can I um, get my... Yeah, there we are. I need to get my artillery to work on these units, or else they'll just tear apart my um, all my units. There. The UK keeps on sending over um, paratroopers, but that isn't going to do too much. It's really just going to be uh, an annoyance. Hmm. I might actually move troops over to the Middle East through Mumbai. I'll see you with time. Oh, come on. There we are. And we have taken that city with really no difficulty. Or not city, that dock. Oh, sorry if you guys hear some uh, background noise. We got some things going on. There we are. Come on. No, oh, we'll take that city eventually. And we have finally broken through the middle of America. And now it is time to move for Washington, D.C., which I plan on taking next turn. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, then please go ahead and leave a like. And thank you guys so much for just the overall channel growth lately. I mean, this channel is just growing ridiculously. It's awesome. Thank you guys. And I really don't have anything else to say. I will see all of you next time. Goodbye.